Hey, what's going on, people? It's back in again, like I always say. I'm excited because today I get to react to none other than the Austin Amazing, the singingest, sangingest, one fourth, the Clark sister herself, Twinkie Clark, in 1991, and the 90s was her years. Can't nobody see Twinkie in her prime. Fight me. Oh, now I'm just playing. But seriously, can't nobody see Twinkie. No one could have saw Twinkie in her prime. You know what I'm saying? When that voice was voicing, them chords was cording, she was singing, and she was singing down. So I'm super excited today. Shout out to the person that requested this video, whose name I don't know or don't recall, but I appreciate you. Um, I'm always ready for Clark's reaction video. So this is Twinkie at Zion Church in 1991. I think this is the one they were talking about. But yeah, sing Twinkie. I'm excited. Uh oh. Uh oh, they hallelujah in it out. Oh my goodness, I missed this. Wait, 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 wait. I love, one thing I always appreciate too about like Twinkie 90s, um, 90s especially, I love the resonance that's in her voice and the tone. It's so rich. It's just like, ah, in that timbre. It's like, ah, sing, ma'am. Sing. I love that. Is there anybody that wants to be leaping for jaw? Yeah. It's like, it's just, ah, it's so, mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. That's it. Spin out on him. Spin out on him. Where is him, y'all? Get your dog back. Get your dog back. Get your dog back. Come on, Twinkie, praise him. Get your dog back. Get your dog back. She's going hard. No, 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 no. Yes.
sunshine. See your life. She started to cook it up. She started cooking up. She started singing in key. I love it. That's one thing I always appreciate about Twinkie. Like back in the day. Like whatever that sound is. And that compression she does. But she like lets that air out. And it's like. She has that level of distortion in her voice. When she like belts high. But like her belts are so clean. So clean. I heard somebody say that. And I agree. I think her belt. She belts like the cleanest one out of the Clark sisters.
you, 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 you. Try him today. It's like, yo, you're gonna be waiting on here when you ran on you. Like, yo, that is always good on sunshine. And then I love it here when you do Hallelujah. Specifically, the version where she had like the long pony, and I think it was like after, um, I think Maddie had passed. She was still like, I think it hit Twinkie pretty hard. The artist, I know it hit all of them hard. I think it really did a number on Twinkie. So she traveled with her all those years. But when she was singing, um, I tried him and I know him, and she was crying. And then she did Hallelujah. And it's just like, wow, it's nothing like hearing Twinkie sing that song. Like Karen owns that song. Um, but Twinkie takes it to a different level and I remember like there's another video I heard of her singing hallelujah and every time like the music falls out That's like the best part in my personal opinion uh, We don't need no music. We don't need no music Is that what you say? Is that what you say? You wanna be glad about it? You wanna be glad about it? You wanna be glad about it? Like, I love it. I love it. I'm always here for it. Clean belts, clean grounds, just, just the creativity and the innovation is always top tier. So, shout out to the person that requested this video. This is always so good, especially 90s Twinkie. 90s Twinkie just, ah, man. Like, yeah, yeah. Like, bless you real good. I'm awesome. Lord, you are so awesome. Awesome. Like, I love hearing Twinkie sing awesome, too. It's just, mm, 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 her voice. Mm, 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 mm. I will be in here all day talking about Twinkie, but if you got another video you want me to react to, comment below and drop the link so I know what you're talking about. As always, don't get better because life does get better. And why? Because Jesus will bring the sunshine and he'll always give you a reason to praise him for what he does, what he's doing, and everything in between. So yeah.